Well, the main problem behind the idea of something like an NHS, um, a uh, socialist type system um, involving redistribution of other people's money, um, the, the, the main problem with it, of course, is that it distorts free prices because a, a market does not operate or a, a fully free market does not operate in that area. Um, it's impossible for those running the system to understand what it is that the customers want, uh, when they want it, and of what quality, um, because there is no rational uh, economic calculation. Because in order to have re rational economic calculation, you need to have profit and loss accounting. Uh, and in order to have profit and loss accounting, you need to make profits. Um, once you take the profit motive away from an institution, um, on what principles do you govern it? How do you make it efficient? Um, uh, as Mises pointed out, you can't make it efficient. And the problem with the NHS is that, what, you know, have, however much of a sacred cow it might be politically, um, its internal contradictions mean that sooner or later it will collapse in chaos and will stop providing any service at all. Um, so it either needs to be reformed, and preferably reformed out of existence and, and replaced with private medical insurance, which incidentally is also free at the point of delivery, or we're going to find it getting worse and worse. And um, I think a lot of people who uh, um, regard the NHS as a sacred cow now um, will be absolutely horrified to see it uh, collapse altogether and leave people needing treatment, le needing care, completely unable to obtain it. Something needs to be done before we get to that point or a lot of people are going to die.